welcome back to another heels video this time it's my classic heels collection at least the first part I have way too many to show all in one video but this video has been requested so hopefully you will enjoy if you're new here make sure you subscribe and please don't forget to like this video because it does help a lot let's get right into the video Hi guys, so hopefully you get the vibe of this video since I am showing my favorite classic styles. I wanted to make this video a little romantic and classic and just relaxing. So hopefully you will appreciate my creative thoughts behind this video. If you do like this video, please don't forget to give this a thumbs up because it does help a lot. First up, we have my ankle stilettos in black. Very classic and a must have in your classic wardrobe. These have a bit of height to them, which is what I like personally. But if you don't like this height, I would recommend the same style, but with like a three inch heel. This is a five inch heel. I've been wearing heels all my life. I actually started pretty early, so I'm kind of used to wearing really high heels. Talk it out, but it won't end. You are never true to heart. You need me when it's getting dark. Got it all, babe. Save arms when you're ready. I'm here when you need me. I'm yours if you let me Got it all, babe Save arms when you're ready I'm here when you need me I'm yours if you let me style that I really love and that I've kept for so many years are these gold stilettos with a shorter heel so it's perfect for daytime and you can walk in these for hours and I promise you your feet does not hurt at all whatsoever I'm not sure why these are so comfortable but they fit very comfortable and they look super classic nothing too fancy nothing too loud or out there i feel like it fits everyone's style when it comes to a classic stiletto and remember these are my personal opinions when it comes to a classic heel maybe a classic heels means something different for you but in this video i am showing some of my classic styles i do have a lot more but it would take hours and hours since i've been saving up over the years but i will take it in parts this is the first part of my classic heel collection so here we have almost the same style but in nude these ones have a zipper in the back instead of a buckle. You made this work. I made this worse. We felt apart a thousand times, a thousand times. You moved away. I'm here to stay. I wish I could go back in time, back in time. I'm so sorry. That I hurt you so deep Swear I spent the last few years just trying to change I'm on my knees And I'm begging you please Is there any chance you're thinking about me? If I change So these might look 
looks similar to the first pair that I was showing but they are not they have a few details like the pointy front instead of the rounded and it's more covered in the back which give a different look and it's also a double strap around the ankle and also a double strap in the front if you're anything like me and always forget to take off the tag underneath the shoe even though they are like years old they're still there don't ask me why is there any chance you're thinking about me? If I change my page, babe, won't you come back to me? Make no mistakes, babe, won't you come back to me? Come back, come back, come back, won't you? These are my absolute favorite pumps and I would wear them to weddings, to nice classic events, you know, anything that calls for that classic look, these would be my go-to's. And I've had these for years and they still look pretty nice, right? With that said, this style is timeless. I like this color because it matches my skin tone. So I recommend getting a pair of these that matches your skin tone because your legs will look so nice. So since they are glossy or shiny, whatever you want to call it, it gives it more of a luxurious look. And compared to a matte pump, these definitely look more dressed up. So this is the same style but in black and definitely way pricier. This is a luxury brand and they're so uncomfortable. When I first got them in New York, I used to wear them to the clubs to go out. I don't know how I did it and now they mostly stand on my shelf and just to look nice. I would never get rid of them because I have a lot of memories in them. But they're definitely a classic style. And it does happen that I would wear them. But only to events where I can sit. I'm not going to stand up in these.
forget to give this video a thumbs up because I need to know what you guys want to see and it also helps me a lot. Make sure you follow me on all my social medias to keep up with me and stay tuned for more videos and more content. Thanks for watching!